So, a ton of you have been telling me to buy a new implement for my tractor because I need it. I'll let you press pause and type in the comments what you think that implement might be if you are one of our subscribers who comments on a regular basis. You're wrong, it's not pallet forks. We have a new to us, heavy duty, mega welded together back blade for uh, grading out our roads. So this thing here has like three quarter inch steel. Uh, that's from a grader blade. Um, it's so heavy. This thing has been the tool that has kept our road in good shape. But my neighbor who doesn't, hasn't lived up here for a couple years hasn't been up here using this blade, but I bought it off of him. So I'm gonna take the backhoe off of the tractor tonight and throw in the back blade and see how it works with my tractor. Okay, well, that's gonna be very difficult to get back on, but that's for another day, whatever.
All right, this is our hill coming down. Juniper, look out. We've got, uh, I don't know what to call them, divots from runoff coming down and just kind of washing out certain areas. Lots of bumps. And then Greg has also been taking soil to widen out this hill. So from up at the top, so there's a lot of like mess there. So we're gonna go see how this does. the trick and something that we noticed from the previous owner when they were using it is you gotta do a lot of trips all the time just to uh, keep it really level and obviously it's been so long since this has been done that there's so much unevenness to the road it's gonna take a little while for it to get completely leveled out and scraped down in the high spots but I don't think there's anything that Greg likes more than driving his tractor. <laughs> this has got to be the most beautiful time in the day. Golden hour when the sun is setting and it's just so golden on the trees, all the green fresh leaves. Everything seems super vibrant right now because of all the rain that we've had. It's just beautiful. Smart, you know better. And like with most new things in life, when you start doing something new, it usually takes a little while to get used to it and kind of figure things out. So I'm sure in no time, Greg will have this road very nice. Greg thinks that this will work better if the blade's on an angle because it's obviously built, it's holding all of the dirt on the one side. So if it's angled, it should pull the dirt inwards or outwards, I don't know. Anyways, we're uh, gonna put the blade on an angle and see how it goes. Did you get the stick, Boo Boo? Oh, look, she's so proud. She's so proud. Can I have it? Oh, no. I got it. Drop. Drop it. Drop. Good girl. You ready? How far off do you have to go? I gotta take this off. Move this. I think you just spin it. Oh, this sits in here too. Well, you got to put it down on the ground. Yeah. And then. 
Well, then this it, has to stay in, but you have to no, move because, these ones. Well, no, this doesn't stay in only when I go flat. I think I'm going to find a different way to do this. this like a big old pin. Not a big old bolt. Like Good, it's not going to fall off, is it? Yeah, it is. Totally it is. You need to put it down, I think. This has to stay in. You're totally you, right, Katie. And then you turn it. Why didn't you tell me that in the first place? I just did. Katie. Okay, can you direct that while I lower it? Just don't don't get pinched. Okay, it's coming down. Okay. Now how do you do this? Why isn't that bolted down? That's a good question. Keep going. What's that? Keep going. Okay.
Well, I think I'm gonna leave Greg out there to do some blading on the road. I'm getting cold, so I'm going inside. <laughs>